Okay, so this is part two. I've probably done these videos separately because it just saves me a lot of time. I've done this now through Audacity instead of using my camera because it takes too long to do the camera. Audacity is just two clicks. Okay, so now we're doing on humans impact. So the humans impact on the aquatic biome is that throughout human existence we have relied on the ocean for food as a waste stump for recreation for economic opportunities and so on however it's not only our activities in the marine environment that affect life in the sea it's also things we do on the land with more than half the world's population now living within 100 kilometers of the coast it's not surprising that our activities are taking their toll human impact have increased along with our rapid population growth substantial development in technology and significant changes in land use Overfishing population and introduced species are affecting life in the sea, and New Zealand is no exception. Okay, so I've just read that from, like, finding out on the internet, so I went looking through for some information. I just read a block that I thought would actually make sense. I think I understand that it as much of that as possible. That made no good sense. That was horrible English. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to read through the next bit and I'll be back in a sec. Okay, so I've read the next bit and here's what I've got. Okay, so we've always relied on the ocean for food and now because we're advancing in our technology getting bigger ships and getting better tracking technology to find the fish it's ridiculously reducing the amount of fish in the ocean and seas okay so also the oceans have been used as a dumping ground for a lot of stuff such as chemicals and sewage but in more recent times, policies change, policy changes in many countries have reflected the view that the ocean does not have an infinite capacity to absorb our waste. However, marine population, no, per, pollution <laughs> remains a major problem and threatens life in the sea at all levels. The good thing is that some of this pollution is just accidental such as oil spills which cause by tanker accidents and yeah you may have the cut in audio is because I went to check something and noticed it was a little bit messed up so I had to edit it out and rechange that but yeah that is all I've got for the human part so I'll see you in the next part if I have a next part I will check my last thing.